Okay, so I'm doing a chicken masala. It's T I K K A masala. So I did not prepare nothing. I got my chicken thighs, skin, uh, skinless and boneless. And I rinsed them off and now I'm just taking out some of the water. Now we got to marinate that. I didn't take anything out, nothing's prepared, so I'm winging it. We are winging this. So plain yogurt. Just plain yogurt. We got to let this set, see, for a little bit. So, and then I can prepare the onion and garlic or whatever, but anyway. Okay, so this is totally from scratch. We're winging it. So plain yogurt and chicken. So I'm going to take about that much of it, depending on how much chicken you got, right? So we got the yogurt. Okay. Chicken and yogurt. Make sure it's all mixed in good. Now, minced garlic. Get my garlic out. I think I need it. <coughs> the top onion over there. But I don't need it for here. Okay. So we'll put that aside. And the garlic. Okay. So I'm gonna mince. Mince some garlic. This is really great from scratch. No crap, no nothing. Put this over here for now. So I'm going to take about... I don't know. I think I need my garlic in the other... Yeah. So, I'll keep the garlic out. I'm just going to do three... three bulbs right now. Okay. Can you see? Three. Three. There's one. This is really from scratch. Two. And three. Let's make sure you guys can hear me. Got a lot going on in the background, but I got my I got my faithful mic right there, so you should be able to hear me. Okay, so three garlic. Got it. Get my garlic thingy. Get my garlic. Garlic thing. Now, LaFonda was reading, they said, what, they asked the question, what uh, useless appliance, um, utensil, kitchen utensil, someone said this, but no, 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 they might like doing it by hand, but this is it for sure, then someone said electric can opener, I agree with that one. I did, we had one and I didn't like it. I did not like the electric can opener. I don't know. I had one. Okay, so we're going to need this again. So I'm not going to... Uh, I have to do some again. So I'm just going to keep that there. I'm going to put the yogurt back in the fridge though. Because... Okay, so we got the garlic in there. And mix it in with the chicken. So we got the garlic. Mix it in good. So yogurt, chicken, and garlic. Now, get rid of this. Because oh, it'll stick to everything. Those garlic things. 
everywhere. Just, just fly. Wash my hands. Okay. I washed these up yesterday. Now, minced garlic. Okay, so I'm going to make my own G-A-R-A-M mas masala. So, usually you put ginger and all that and nutmeg and whatever you want. Anyways, but instead of me doing that, I picked up allspice. That, that already got the ginger and the everything in it, right? So... I picked up the allspice and I need it for this and I need it when I uh, how do you take this thing off to take the I don't know I gotta take it off in order to get at that well 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 okay so I need Double one for here and one for an frying pan. So what I'm going to do is take some allspice, put put a bunch there, allspice. Okay, there's the allspice, and there's the allspice. Put it away after. I'll put it. Right there, allspice and cumin. So, take the cumin. And you can put as much as you want. Some people don't like it, it's too strong, but anyway, I'm just gonna put some over here. Cumin, allspice and cumin. Okay. And it is strong. I'm not gonna put too much of it. I'll put it back if I don't what I don't use. Okay, and um turmeric. Pick this up. Why do they got things on all okay. Right there, I gotta take it out of there. So turmeric. Turmeric. Come on, baby. that thing out of it. Yeah. So turmeric, cumin, all spice. Okay. Put this back on. Okay. Wow. Turmeric. So I've got a pile of turmeric. Now, I got my singly up here. I can use, maybe I can put cinnamon, not that. Where is it? Pumpkin spice. Paprika. Paprika. Of course, I don't have much. It's in that thing. Oh man, why didn't I check? You know, sometimes I don't know. I wonder about me. Okay, where's the paprika? I know I got a bunch, bunch of that crap. Okay, excuse me for a sec. Paprika. I got my bag of spices, see? Okay, paprika. Paprika. That's poultry, onion. I know I got tons of paprika, but I like that chili. Oh, there's cinnamon, paprika. There we go. Paprika. There. Okay, pull it in. So we've got the paprika. Paprika. Okay, so we've got paprika. And where's my paprika at? Right here. Nope, that's pumpkin. Paprika. I'll just fill it up. Fill it back up again. I use, I mostly use it just for color and never change. But, you know. okay. Should have picked up more of these at Dollar Store, eh? But I only get enough to 
Oh, that. I would have to get another. I'm going to have to get another one. I'll figure out something. Okay. So. We're doing good, aren't we? I think we are. So that's all my spices. Okay. So. Put that back up there again. And then I'll put that back up again. And that's a pumpkin spice. That's pepper. Got lots of pepper. Okay. So. All spice, cumin, turmeric, and paprika. Okay. Let's see. And I got the garlic in here. And now what do we do? Okay. So I'm going to take, I don't want too much of cumin, tamarack, allspice, and paprika. Okay, so that's going to be for the same. And they said salt, and they said chili. Like just a little. Ooh, holy. I think that'll be really hot, eh? Let me get rid of some of that. I don't want to burn my salt. Spread it out. Come on. There. Take, get rid of some. There, that should be good. Okay. <coughs> you need that many forks. Where's the same? Right here. Okay, so now what we're going to do is mix all this stuff, and while that's setting in the fridge, I'll cut the onion, make sure this is mixed up really, really good, really, really good to check it. And then, so... Well, that's satin, because it's too early to eat. They're, they're still sleeping. I might cut this, shut this down for an hour or so until I'm ready to cook it and then do a second part. So that has to set in the fridge for an hour or so. So I'm going to set that in the fridge for an hour or so, come back, and then I'll cook up the chicken and Los Juan de Vietnam. I got the rice. I got the jasmine rice. And she can cook up the rice. So I'm going to put this in the fridge. I'll chop up the onion. Have the onion because I've got to set for about an hour. And then I'll have. So I'll see you back in an hour. That'll be part two of cooking it, okay? So I'm going to go out for a smoke and see you in an hour. So the chicken, uh, the chicken marinated, so the chicken marinated, see it all marinate, the yogurt and the chicken and this is part two. So now what they say to do is put margarine, margarine and vegetable oil in a pan. I'm not going to do the frying pan because it'll be way too much. I have to use that, that pan there. And then I'm going to let it simmer while the rice is cooking. Then I'll do uh, a thumbnail when I'm just going to let this simmer and then let the rice and then when the fonda wakes up, I'll do a thumbnail of my plate and then we'll record eating it. See if she likes it. She she tastes the canned one before, so she prefers the butter chicken, but anyway, we'll see. So, got the oil and the uh, butter. You don't put that much butter. It's not butter chicken. You don't put curry. So, I'm not making a butter chicken. So, you take... I'm going to warm it up a little bit, put the chicken in it. And I did get the garlic ready to uh, crunch up anyway this time. 
So have that ready. I didn't do my didn't do the onion though. And then I got the can. And then okay. So chop the onion. And I bought I'll show you in a second. So I'm doing the onion. Chop up the onion here. Some onion. Okay. Do some onion. I'm doing enough a half of onion. They say do a big one, but I don't know. I do have quite a bit of chicken. I could do a whole onion. One onion. Could do. I'm gonna do one one onion. Just chop it up. Nothing fancy. The jasmine rice. I like the sticky rice, but I picked up jasmine for this one. Okay, so we got the onion. It's all cut up. That's warm. The margarine and the oil. The margarine and the oil. So it says to put this in it. There. So you put that in it. Let it cook a little bit. Let it cook good. And then, I've got this. I don't need that anymore. I've got my spices. And I should open my tomato paste. So, then it says, you got to put a little bit of sugar after, and you got to put, guess what you got to put, guess what, and it said it in a recipe, it's not mine, it's not mine, it's not my recipe, not my recipe, so let the chicken cook up good here, chicken cook up good, and make sure I get the sugar so I don't forget just a little bit of sugar could be brown sugar sugar set and get that ready and it said to put the okay. job I picked up a couple today guess what it said Canned milk! Just said to put canned milk. Oh, I'll put canned milk. Set to put it. That's my recipe right there. Anything with canned milk, they know what they're talking about. Canned milk. Now, put this up a little bit. Just the chicken cooking, and um, I can't put the pan on, so. And I didn't have ginger. They said to put ginger because ginger is not in all spice. I do have the pumpkin spice, which would have ginger in it, probably. But it would have, I don't know. Let's smell it. because it's more cinnamon. I'm not going to. Because uh, I got the all spice. That's okay. I'll put a little bit of sugar. Sweeten it up a little bit, right? So I'm cooking up the chicken here. Just cooking up the chicken. See if I can move you guys without dropping this. I'm cooking up the chicken. I've got the onions, the garlic, my spices, my tomato, my canned milk, and my sugar. That's what it says. Onion, garlic, that. And I put the paprika already in there, so I've got everything. Everything. Okay, so put this up. 
and then I'll let it simmer after the chicken cooks here. Then I'll, when I got everything, I'll put it on low, let it simmer, do the rice when she wakes up, then I'll do a thumbnail. Oh, this is what I got. I'm going to use it like a spoon. The tortilla wraps, tita wraps, flour tortillas, okay. And use it like a spoon, right? You put it on top of your rice and then just use these as a spoon sort of thing. Eat it with your hands, so I've got ten of them. So yeah, you're gonna use them as a spoon. You don't you don't need a spoon when you got these. You just cut a piece off and go like that. That's gonna taste good. Okay, so do up the chicken here a little bit. And then I'll just let it simmer on low. It smells good, so let's see. I had to leave the door and everything open. I had no choice, so I got my my mic over here. So you should be able to hear me. I don't want to forget the sugar. I definitely need that sugar. There. So I got the mic with me. And I got it up on high. Make sure this chicken is cooked halfway anyway. Okay. So I'm gonna start with the garlic. Okay. Oh, what did I do with that knife? Yeah. Okay. So there's the garlic. Garlic in the in there. Okay, do another one. Got a lot of garlic. Okay. Garlic in there and one more. Okay. I've got the peppers. It's gonna be it's going to be hot and spicy. So, so there's the garlic. There's the garlic. Got the chicken kind of good here. Okay. Now, put the onion. All this onion. I'm gonna put the milk. I don't want it to curdle. I'll turn it down. The milk will be the last because I don't want it to curdle. So the onion. Onion. There. The onion. That around. So good. I don't know. I think I did the coconut. Uh, oh, I had something in mind for next week. But I might do the but butter chick uh, uh, butter chicken, but with the curry in that, but not with the coconut, maybe. Because I don't use all these spices. See, it's almost the same, eh? So you use your curry and your and a lot of butter to do the butter one. This one, only a little bit of butter. Okay. So that has to thicken. So we need that needs to simmer because it needs to thicken. So I'm gonna use all that pretty much. Because I want it to thicken really good. This is a tomato paste. It has a simmer as it's supposed to. It's not too runny. It's not too runny. Okay. <clears throat> it's not too thick, but it's not too runny. Does that make sense? 
not too sick. Not too, too warm. Okay, so got that in there. Now I gotta get more of that. We got more. We got more. So I'm not putting too much cumin. Put more, more spice. Paprika. There. And now what I'm going to do is mix it all together. Find a thing for it and label it. I'll label it uh, G A R A M Masala. I'll label it and then I'll know what it is. Okay, put that in there. And I can turn it down a little now. And I'll let that thicken right out. Put that tomato paste. I'll turn that down. And I want to make sure I put some of the sugar in because I don't, I don't have ginger. I probably, I might have it up here, but I don't think I bought it because I just used the, the pumpkin spice. So I'm going to put two. They say to put one, but I want to sweeten it up a little bit more. So. Yeah, I'm doing my video here. Yeah, I'm almost done. I'm going to let this simmer and then I'll do the rice and then we'll be ready to eat. This has to simmer and cook a little bit. So it is sicken up. Can milk. It says a cup. Yes, yeah, I'm pointing that way. She, she will. I'm almost done. I'm almost done here. So, that has to simmer a little bit. Because that chicken has to cook up. What time is it? So, that has to cook until at least 4 o'clock. And then we'll do the, then we'll do the rice, eh? Let that cook a little. I got it on like four. So I got it on four. And it's not as red as what I wanted it. But I'm not putting any more. I could put a little bit more paprika in. Not as just for coloring paprika. Okay, so, and then you'll see it on a plate, it'll be thicker. Okay, so let that cook. I got it like between four and five. See, so I'm going to let that cover back on it. Let it simmer and then do the rice and then we'll do when I'm going to put all this together and label it all those spices mix it together because it's pretty much almost I have to check the buttered chicken has the same the same spice I think so but I gotta spare one of these that I can see I got curry I got I'll do another one Push that over and then put it there, see? That's steak. And what is this one? That's basil. Okay. And put it there. Mix it all together really good. Yeah. So let's see. I don't want this to bubble and stick, so... Number four. Let that cook really, really good and then we'll do the rice. That's our supper. So, that's about it.
when the rice is done, I'll do a thumbnail and then we'll record us eating it, okay? So that, this is part two. So you just let that simmer and, and cook and do your rice up and that's about it. So see you in a bit when we're eating.